Hi, this is Jim Kopseff. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the cash on cash return. I'm going to use my iCalculator program because it's easier to show you the formula and the process. So the first thing we do is we, after we open iCalculator is we go to the toolbar we select investment up here. This lists all the various calculations you can make for investment type uh, computations and we select cash on cash return. That opens up the cash on cash form that we would need to fill out. Now every calculator shows the definition. So in this case you'll see we have that cash on cash is the ratio as a percentage between the property's cash flow in a particular year, usually before taxes, and the amount of initial cash investment. The initial cash investment consists of the down payment, loan points, and closing costs, such as escrow, title, and appraisal fees. Okay, so let's say our initial cash investment is 100,000. Our gross rental income is 50,000. Our vacancy rate is 4%. Our operating expenses are 28%, that is 28% of GOI. And our debt service is 25,000. Now debt service is the annual mortgage payment. So once we put that in, we calculate. And as you can see, the result is 9.56%. The solution shows us how we got there. We have the gross rental income, that's the annual income collected from rents, less the vacancy allowance, then less the operating expenses, less the mortgage payment, that gives us a cash flow of $9,560. We divide that by the initial cash investment of 100,000 and we get 9.56%. Here's the formulation. Cash flow divided by initial cash investment is cash on cash return. Thank you for watching.